We've learned about a positive case at a Williamsburg James City County School. A student at Stonehouse Elementary School tested positive. Today, that student's class went back to remote learning. Nico Clements spoke with a concerned parent. This is very surprising. Another COVID-19 positive case in Williamsburg James City County Schools. Only this time, it's a student. The school division's COVID-19 dashboard shows the student goes to Stonehouse Elementary School. A division spokeswoman says the student who tested positive was in the building for less than an hour Monday and wasn't on campus prior to yesterday. As a precaution, the student's class resumed remote learning for two weeks. Everyone else in the school, kindergarten through fifth grade, will continue with blended learning. At some point, everybody's going to catch it. Kimberly Brennan's son is a first grader at Stonehouse. However, she opted to have her son learn virtually the entire school year because of COVID-19. There's no hesitation about cleanliness there at all. Um, so hearing that there's a COVID case at Stonehouse, is very surprising to me. So yesterday, Virginia Beach City Public Schools temporarily suspended in-person classes for all students and shifted back to virtual learning. Williamsburg James City County Schools is considering that option. I do think that they did go back a little too early. Hampton City Schools also announced that all students will temporarily go back to virtual learning after Thanksgiving as an additional proactive measure. Brennan said she's going to wait and see. When we have a full Yes, it is definitely 100% safe for your child's return to school, then I'll go from there. Schools and parents now making tough decisions as COVID-19 remains a concern inside classrooms. In James City County, Nico Clemens, 13 News Now.